Hi, I'm Paul Rodelavich from Synergy Electrical Sales. One of the questions we get asked a lot is about if I have a battery backup in a fixture and I'm using lighting controls, do I need a separate relay or an additional device involved? So I'm gonna show you how it works so you understand it a little bit better. So in our fixture, we have our LED driver and in as our hot as our neutral and then coming out of the driver we have our LEDs which are low voltage so we're going to show you those there now lighting controls whether it's um, a dimming system I'm just going to show it here as a switch okay and we're going to have our distribution panel here. All right, it's all basic stuff. So we've got our circuit coming out, right? It's gonna turn the driver on and off, turn our LEDs on and off. So this is the one part that gets people a little bit confused is when you have a battery in the fixture, okay? Switch can turn this on and off right here but we also need to bring unswitched, okay, to the battery, which is all inside the fixture. I'm just gonna show a little dot here. Okay, that's all in the fixture. All right, so this is where people get, get confused. From the battery, the battery actually has a wire here that goes right to the LEDs after the driver. So if we lose this unswitched circuit, which is also the same circuit that feeds here, automatically it switches to the battery, lights your LEDs to a lower lumen level, regardless of the switch position. As always, thanks for watching.